Hello beauty news family, welcome to this week's episode of The Makeup Breakup. This is a series where we destroy makeup. We upload new videos every Wednesday, so if you would like to see more, don't forget to smash that subscribe button before we smash some makeup. Welcome back to The Makeup Breakup, guys. Today we have some marble lipsticks from Lipstick Queen. So these are Method in the Madness lipsticks. We've got four shades to take a look at today. We have Nonsense Nude. Peculiar Pink, Crazed Greige, and Reckless Red. So what we're going to do today is um, we're going to choose one to destroy. We're going to weigh that. Uh, but before we get into it, we are going to swatch all of the colors and take a look at what the different shades become when the marbled shades mix together. Yes. All right, swatches. First up, Nonsense Nude. None of your nonsense, nude. It's streaky. Streaky. <laughs> it's streaky because there's actually a streak of purple in there. Um, yeah. But it ends up being quite a nice... It's a really pretty color. It's like a velvet teddy type yeah. nude. Yeah, it is. All right, I see ya. We're keeping you. Yes. Next up is Peculiar Pink. Oh, sunrise. It is sunrisey. Oh, wow. <laughs> so there's a dark splotch of pink right on the edge. Um, Lines so your lips it, for you. It's lining the lips. Next up is Crazed Greige. That's super purple. It is. There is like nude in there or pinky Lightning. shade, but yeah. It's only really here. Yeah. To the side. It's, um, yeah so you, you might be tail. able to see it there. And the last one is Reckless Red. It's very orangey red. It is. I would say it's more office red, not reckless red. Yes, this is well behaved red. <laughs> this is home before 8 pm red. <laughs> In your pajamas, Mate. watching The Bachelor. It ain't no reckless red. I've been there. That's not it. So to find out what the usable portion of this lipstick is, we're going to cut it down to where you would be able to use it if you were applying this naturally to your lips. So if you were using the lipstick, you would typically get to this point and there's two types of people. You would consider it done and throw it in the bin. Or if you love, love, love it, you might get a lip brush and dig out the extra product. What we're gonna do is weigh it at this point and see how much is in the usable portion. And then we're gonna dig it out and see how much is in it total. So the usable portion or this part of the lipstick contained 2.68 grams in this particular lipstick. Um, so it doesn't, the, the 3.5 grams that the lipstick claims to contain is not just in the usable portion of the lipstick. Um, the rest of it is probs gonna be down in here. So let's get it out. how the, you look you can kind of see a color variation yeah the lipstick like yeah it does look i don't know maybe it's just the outside looks more marbled than the inside maybe of it. maybe yeah all right since we've got a mess here um before we clean it up to weigh the tube again we're just gonna like cut through it and mush it up see what color it looks it makes. very it does look really really pink doesn't it are you it? finding that the marble is mainly on the outside I it's feel like, no, there is marble in there that I can see, but the pink is really like the predominant color. Which is good. So yeah, it's, a pink it's lipstick. meant to be a pink lipstick. But look lipstick. at the difference between the outside. Yeah, there's much more. It, it, it appears, looks like a nude pink. It appears that there's much more nude on the outside 
as you sort of scrape through it, you can see little bits of nude yeah. come through, but yeah, it's very kinky. Let's put this one away. Just so you can mush. And you can comfortably mush. So the total amount of product in the lipstick was 4.21 grams. So almost a gram over what was claimed. If you dig into it. If you dig into it. Look, if that's you, great. If it's not, welcome to the club. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, it's a pretty looking lipstick. And it if is. If you really love it, you yeah. might want to have a dig. Yes, exactly. It's up to you how you choose to use your lipsticks. Alright, so we're going to slice this down the centre. Does, doesn't it? I think there you can really see how much it is marbled through there, mm. which is kind of cool. Alright guys, we hope you enjoyed this episode of The Makeup Breakup. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and we will see you in the next one. Bye. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> this is when we need Dr. Pimple Popper. We just made massive zits out of lipstick. Okay. That's so gross. Collab goals. Hi, Dr. Pimple Popper. <laughs> Love you. Mwah. <laughs>